first, there were hundreds, but now the crowds number in the tens of thousands. In Dresden and other German cities, the right-wing Pegida movement has brought people to the streets, spreading fears of a so-called Islamification of the West. Pegida is steadily gaining power. Even German Chancellor Angela Merkel warned citizens about the movement. Do not follow the people appealing for this. Too often prejudices, coldness and even hatred is in their hearts. Although several anti-Pegida movements have sprung up to oppose the protests, the public is still uncertain as to how to deal with Pegida effectively. However, a group of students at the Macromedia University in Berlin has decided to send their own special message to Pegida by developing a project committed to the social inclusion of refugees. It's called the Booklet of Participation. We gather tickets from different culture and sport institutions so that refugees have the opportunity to attend cultural events that they maybe never would have had the chance to attend otherwise. Each week, the students look for new, free tickets. And also, they have created a web page and made flyers and stickers in order to attract the public to the plight of refugees. When meeting the students, one can feel their commitment to this issue. Honestly, at the beginning I approached it with mixed feelings. I didn't even have an idea on what a refugee's lifestyle could look like in Germany. When we started visiting refugee asylums and the people that lived there, we were all very shocked. But there, Bob actually has the power to make a difference. A young man living in Berlin, Friedrichshain, is one of the refugees to profit from the project. I think that sometimes refugees would have loved to go to an event, to see what German people are doing. But they weren't able to go. Let's take opera, for example. No Arabian here knows about opera. It's a cool project. It's good for both, refugees and Germans. Stage performances, concerts and sport events like the ice hockey matches at EHC Eisbären Berlin shall make refugees like Adil feel more at home in the city. But this goal can only be fulfilled if the Bob project has numerous supporters. Eisbären Berlin has been one of the first. They agreed on donating tickets for a good cause right from the spot. My ideal outcome is that the flat people coming here are going to have fun. And of course that they will be surrounded by welcoming people, that the refugees will be integrated and get in touch with the citizens of Berlin. This way, the Bob project sends a positive signal to refugees, a signal against the growing cultural intolerance in certain parts of Germany. We want to accomplish that the refugees will get in touch with the German population. By bringing people together, we want to do something against the many prejudices, clichés and stereotypes towards foreigners and people from other countries that we are witnessing in our society at the moment. With this initiative, the students of Macromedia University are definitely on the right track to ensuring that we always remember that Germany has and always should be a tolerant, inclusive society for all, especially refugees.